Hey everyone, uh, I wanted to do a quick video concerning uh, the uh, actually adapter, the adapter for your PS uh, VR to be compatible with uh, the PS5. So pleasantly surprised, it actually came in today. We are November 12th, obviously the official uh, launch of the PS5, not all over the world, but in certain regions. Uh, I put in my order last week, really, really surprised that it actually came in in time, but I'm uh, really happy about that. So it's it's actually a pretty straightforward uh, dongle. You have your standard USB, uh, I'm guessing it's probably 3.0, uh, that will uh, plug uh, into your uh, PS5. And it's going to be hard to see, but the inside, uh, let's see if I can get this a little bit. There you go. Like the inside uh, of this actual block is that other uh, sword you could call it, I guess, USB, where the uh, your PSVR would actually come and plug itself in. So uh, it's not that big, just a couple inches, a um, couple inches long. Uh, build quality is really good as well. I'm surprised that this thing is the brick here that they made it this big. It seems like it's almost to protect the inside. Uh, so that it doesn't get loose. But again, very, very surprised and super happy that it came in. I heard that there's a lot of actual uh, PS5 enhanced uh, PSVR games. Blood and Truth, uh, apparently uh, I sent out a, uh, a post on Instagram saying that they uh, have some PS5 uh, upgrades. Um, I'm hoping to get my PS5 tomorrow as well. I was lucky enough to get a, um, a pre-order. So we'll see what happens. So I'm looking forward to plugging this guy in into my PS5, plugging in my PSVR and seeing what type of quality um, upgrades I'm going to be getting. There was also some patches that came out on the um, uh, on Astrobot. Astrobot actually had a had an update. We don't really know anything about it. I saw the same thing with uh, Resident Evil 7. So I'm sort of speculating that maybe uh, these uh, developers or coming out with patches uh, in order to have and to use the uh, updated power on the PS5. So that's it for my end, guys. I just wanted to show that. The other thing as well, it did come with, I guess, some tiny little manual that shows you exactly how to connect uh, the dongle to your uh, PS5. So that should be pretty, pretty straightforward. So that's it for today. Uh, I will be posting more uh, videos uh, with uh, you know, with some streaming for uh, the PS5. Thank you.